Hi, boys and girls. For our functional activity today, we are going to practice tying our shoes, okay? So you're going to need a sneaker or something else that needs the laces tied, okay? All right, so let's get started. All right, to tie our shoe, we need to have a lace in each of our hands, okay? And then what we're going to do is we're going to cross the laces. See how I made an X? I made the X. And then I'm going to put my finger through this hole and pull the one through, all right? And then we actually can tighten that a little bit so it's right next to the tongue of the shoe. The next step then is to make a loop with one hand and you're gonna keep a hold of that in this hand. And then you're gonna grab the other lace, wrap it around, and we're going to tuck it through. I'm gonna turn the shoe sideways so you can see. We're gonna grab part of the lace so that we have a little bit of a loop, okay? And then what we're going to do is we're gonna pull from the laces, all right? And we should make a, a little loop on both sides. So what you can do if you need to make it a little tighter, you just pull it a little tighter. And then you actually, can make a, a double knot if you don't want it to go anywhere. See how I did that? All right, so if you need help with that, maybe what you can do, I'm gonna untie this so I can show you. If that's too hard for you, usually when we're in school, we actually do what's called backwards chaining for this activity. So parents, if you were to do this at home with your kids, you would do this part, okay? And you would leave this loose here and you would have them practice pulling the loops tight. So that would be the first step in teaching your child how to tie their shoes. Now, if they already knew how to pull those loops tight, then you would again start over, get to this point, and maybe the next step would be to teach them how to pull this lace through and then pull the loops tight. So that's what's called backwards chaining. So sometimes a difficult task, like tying your shoes, is sometimes easiest to do when you start at the end and actually work your way forwards instead of working at the beginning and working your way to the end, okay? Awesome job, boys and girls, you did so great. We're gonna sing a fun song next, okay? I'll see you then, bye.